What is the main advantage of a magneto ignition system over a battery ignition system? A magneto has its own source of electrical energy and is not dependent on the battery. What is the function of a capacitor in a magneto? 1. Minimizes arcing at the breaker points 2. Speeds up the collapse of the primary current as the breaker points open. What is a compensated magneto cam and on what kind of engine is it used? A special cam for high-performance radial engines with one loop per cylinder, each low ground in such a way that the breaker points open when the pistons in the different cylinders are the same linear distance from top center. What is the significance of the numbers on the distributor of an aircraft magneto? Sparking order of the magneto. What happens in a magneto ignition system when the ignition switch is placed in the off position? The primary circuit is connected to ground. What is the reason for having a low tension ignition system on some aircraft? Low tension magnetos are used in aircraft that fly at high altitudes where there is a problem with flash over in high tension magneto distributors. What is the basic difference between a low tension magneto and a high tension magneto? High tension magnetos produce high voltage in the magneto coil and it is sent to the correct spark plug by the built-in high distribution distributor. Low tension magnetos have only one coil in the magneto and sends low voltage to high tension transformers on each cylinder head. What is the difference between hot spark and a cold spark plug? Hot spark plugs are longer and have a long path for the heat to travel from the nose core insulator to the spark plug shell. Cold spark plugs operate cooler as the heat has less distance to travel. What is meant by spark plug reach? Length of threads of a spark plug that screw into the cylinder head. What is an all-weather spark plug? A shielded spark plug that has a recess in the shielding in which a resilient grommet on the ignition lead forms a watertight seal. What is check when a magneto is internally timed? The adjustment of the breaker points to open at the E-gap position and the rotor position directs high voltage to cylinder number 1. What is the purpose of a vernier coupling used on some aircraft magneto drives? Magnetos that are base mounted must have a vernier coupling between the magneto drive and the engine which allows timing to be varied in increments of less than 1 degree. What is the advantage of fine wire spark plugs over massive electrode spark plugs? Fine wire spark plugs have a firing end that is more open than that of a massive electrode spark plug. The open firing end allows gases that contain lead to be purged from the spark plug so that they will not form solid lead contaminants. Why is it important that spark plugs be kept in numbered holes in a tray when they are removed from an engine? They tell a great deal about the internal condition of the cylinder from which they were taken, detonation, overheating, etc. What is the purpose of staggered timing between the two magnetos on an aircraft engine? Engines in which the exhaust gas scavenging from the cylinders is uneven use staggered ignition timing. The spark plug nearest the exhaust valve where fuel-air mixture is diluted fires before the intake side spark plug so the flame meets at the center of the piston. In which position should the ignition switch be placed when using a timing light on the magnetos? In the both position. Why is a torque wrench important to use when installing spark plugs? To avoid the possibility of a loose, poor seal or over-tightening and cracking the insulation. Why are pressurized magnetos used on most reciprocating engine-powered aircraft that fly at high altitudes? Pressurized air is better than less dense air as it prevents arcing across the wrong electrode, causing vibration and loss of engine power. What type of ignition system is used on most turbine engines? High intensity intermittent duty capacitor discharge ignition systems. What is meant by the E-gap? 
The E-gap angle is the position of the rotating magnet when the primary current flowing in the magnetocoil is the greatest. The breaker points open when the rotating magnet is in the E-gap position. What is the function of the impulse coupling? What kind of gauge should be used to measure the spark plug electro gap? Round wire gauge. How many igniters are used in most turbine engines? 2. What are the two types of ignition systems used in turbine engines? High voltage and low voltage systems. With which type of ignition system is a glow plug used? Low voltage system. How is the strength of the magnet in a magneto checked? The magneto is put on a test stand, rotated at a specified speed with the breaker points held open, and the primary current is measured. The strength of the magnet determines the strength of the primary current. In what position is the magnet in a magneto when the greatest change in flux density in the coil core takes place? It is a few degrees beyond its neutral position. When it is in this position, the breaker points open and the primary current is interrupted. The flux change in the coil core is the greatest. In what position is the magnet in a magneto when the breaker points begin to open? In its E-gap position, just a few degrees beyond its neutral position. What malfunction in the ignition system would cause an aircraft reciprocating engine to continue to run after the ignition switch is placed in the off position? The ignition switch is not grounding the magneto primary circuit. If there is a break in the P-lead wire from the magneto to the switch, then the ignition switch cannot ground the magneto primary circuit. What turns on the auto ignition system in a turboprop engine? A torque pressure switch energizes the system when the engine stops producing torque. What does it mean when the starter relay clicks when the starter switch is placed in the start position? The voltage is too low to supply enough current to the relay coil to fully engage the contact points. What is an advantage of air turbine starters when compared to electric starters for large turbine engines? They are lightweight and do not have the same cool-down periods as electric starters. What are the three major circuits of a high-tension magneto? 1. Magnetic circuit 2. Primary electrical circuit 3. Secondary electrical circuit. What are the components in a magneto? Permanent rotating magnet. Soft iron core. Pole shoes. What is a dual magneto? Two magnetos in one housing that share the rotating magnet and cam. However, they have their own set of points, coils, and distributor blocks. What are the three conditions required to fire the plugs in a cylinder when the piston is in the prescribed position? 1. Magneto magnet poles must be in the E-gap position. 2. Breaker points must open. 3. The distributor rotor must be aligned with the distributor electrode for that cylinder. What is the function of the igniter plugs in a turbine engine? Provides a discharge gap for the current which is stored in the capacitor. What type of ignition system is used in most turbine engines? Electronic capacitor type. When are turbine ignition systems normally in use? Starting or restarting? What are two types of igniter plugs? Annular gap, long reach plug that extends into the combustion chamber constraint gap, short reach plug that does not extend into the combustion chamber because the spark does not remain close to the plug. Where does the fuel metering system of a turbine engine discharge its fuel? Fuel is discharged through spray nozzles into the combustion chambers. What is adjusted when the fuel control unit of a turbine engine is trimmed? 1. Idle speed 2. Maximum thrust speed trim means adjusting the fuel control for proper specific gravity of the fuel and for the proper idle and full throttle RPM. What are two locations where water can be injected into a turbine engine? 
1. Compressor Inlet 2 Inlet to the diffuser section What is meant by a duplex nozzle in a turbine fuel metering system? Duplex nozzles have two fuel discharge passages to keep the flame centered in the burner for all operating conditions. A flow divider sends fuel for low pressure operation through one discharge passage and when the engine demands more fuel, it is sprayed out through the second discharge passage. What is the function of a flow carburetor? 1. Measure air flow in the induction system and dispense the correct amount of fuel into the airflow. 2. Fuel must be delivered in a state that is as vaporized as possible. Does the fuel air mixture provided by a flow carburetor become richer or leaner as the aircraft goes up in altitude? Richer as the aircraft gains altitude. Does the fuel air mixture become richer or leaner when carburetor heat is applied? Richer when carburetor heat is applied. What would happen to the air fuel mixture ratio in a flow carburetor if the main air bleed were to become clogged? Excessively rich mixture. How does the automatic mixture control in a pressure carburetor keep the fuel air mixture constant as the aircraft changes altitude? It automatically and progressively bleeds the air between the two sides of the air diaphragm and decreases the metering force. This leans the mixture as the airplane goes up in altitude. What are two purposes of the manifold valve in the fuel injection system of a horizontally opposed engine? 1. Constant discharge fuel pressure for idling 2. Positive shutoff when when the engine is shut down. How does the mixture control change the fuel-air mixture ratio on the Teledyne Continental fuel injection system? When the mixture control is in full rich position, all fuel goes to the manifold valve. When it is in the idle cutoff position, all fuel is returned to the pump inlet. Intermediate positions vary the amount of fuel that goes to the engine. Why must the diaphragms of a pressure carburetor be soaked before the carburetor is ready for flight? It restores the diaphragms to the condition of flexibility they had when the carburetor was calibrated. What are two basic fuel controls for aircraft turbine engines? Hydropneumatic and Electrohydropneumatic How does the exhaust gas temperature of a recip engine tell anything about the fuel-air mixture being burned in the engine? A stoichiometric mixture produces the highest exhaust gas temperature. The mixture is adjusted to get the highest EGT, and then it is enriched to place it on the rich side of the stoichiometric. Stoichiometric mixture, a mixture in which all the constituents of the fuel-air mixture are burned. What two things are adjusted when adjusting the idling of a reciprocating engine? 1. Idle stop for proper idling RPM 2. Idle mixture through idle needle valve for smoothest operation. What is controlled by the adjustment of the orifice in the fuel pump of a Teledyne Continental fuel injection system? High emitted fuel pressure. What is the significance of the letters that are stamped on the flats of a fuel injection nozzle? Smaller the letter, smaller the relative size orifice and fuel flow in the nozzle. What is the function of the Derrick Mint valve in a pressure carburetor used on an aircraft engine with an anti-detonation injection system? The Derry Shement valve automatically closes to lean the fuel-air mixture when the ADI fluid is flowing. As soon as the ADI fluid stops flowing, the Derrick Mint valve opens and the mixture returns to its rich condition. What is the function of the economizer system in an aircraft engine carburetor? In what position is the mixture control placed for starting an engine that is equipped with a pressure carburetor? Idle cut off. This engine is started with fuel from the primer system. In what position is the carburetor heat control placed when starting an aircraft engine? Cold position. Why is an aircraft reciprocating engine killed by placing the mixture control in the cutoff position rather than using the magneto switch? To remove avgas from the pistons for safety and to avoid combustion if the propeller is turned. 
Where is the fuel from a continuous flow injection system discharged? Injector nozzles screw into the cylinder head near the intake valves. In which direction relative to the wind should a turbine-powered aircraft be positioned when the fuel control is being trimmed? If wind velocity is 10 to 25 miles per hour, it should be facing the wind. What engine parameters are sensed by the fuel control unit of a turbine engine? 1. RPM 2. Inlet air pressure 3. Compressor discharge pressure 4. Burner can pressure 5. Inlet air temperature. When does the acceleration system operate on an aircraft carburetor? When the throttle is suddenly opened. What are two types of electronic fuel controls for turbine engines? 1. Supervisory Electronic Engine Control 2. Full Authority Digital Electronic Control What is a FATIC? Full Authority Digital Electronic Control uses an electronic engine control and the flight management computer to measure the fuel nozzle that prevents overspeed and overting conditions. It also sends information to indication systems for the aircraft crew. Does the FATIC require manual trimming? Self trimming. Are all the instruments installed on an aircraft suitable to trim the turbine engine? No, a turbine engine requires specialized tools. What specifications are used to trim a turbine engine? The data plate on the engine typically contains the trimming specifications. Where should ambient temperature be measured when trimming a turbine engine? In a shaded area as close to the intake as possible. What engine variables are sensed by a hydromechanical fuel control? 1. Power lever position 2. RPM 3. Compressor inlet pressure temperature 4. Burner pressure 5. Compressor discharge pressure 6. EGT or TIT. What are the two most commonly used carburetors on a small reciprocating engine? 1. Flow type carburetor 2. Pressure type carburetors What type of fuel control unit is used in a turbine engine? Both hydromechanical and electronic fuel control units are in use today, however, the hydromechanical is the most common. What is the purpose of mixture control in a flow type carburetor? It is used to control fuel-air mixture as air density changes with altitude. What is the purpose of an accelerating system on a flow-type carburetor? When the throttle opens, the fuel-air mixture will lean out momentarily. To overcome this, a charge of fuel from the accelerating pump will temporarily enrich the mixture in the venturi. What is the function of the metering jet? Its purpose is to limit the fuel flow when the throttle is wide open. The main metering jet is placed in the fuel passage between the float chamber and the discharge nozzle. Describe the operation of a carburetor venturi. The principal operation of the carburetor depends on the differential between the atmospheric pressure and the decreased pressure offered by the venturi. 1. It proportions the fuel-air mixture. 2. It lowers the pressure at the discharge nozzle. 3. It limits airflow at full throttle. What is the fuel metering force in a flow-type carburetor? It is differential pressure between the atmospheric pressure on the float bowl and the decreased pressure at the discharge nozzle. What is the fuel pressure in a flow type carburetor? 3 to 5 psi. What are the three types of carburetor icing? 1. Throttle icing. 2. Impact icing. 3. Fuel evaporation icing. What operates the automatic mixture control on a pressure carburetor? The AMC contains a sealed bellows that expands or contracts with atmospheric pressure. The movement of the bellows operates a tapered needle that controls the impact of air pressure in the A chamber of the carburetor. In which position do you place the mixture control of a pressure injection carburetor to STOP the engine? Idle cut off. Where does the pressure injection carburetor obtain fuel pressure? 
Boost pump for starting engine driven pump for normal operations. What will be the result of using excessively rich idle mixtures? Carbon fouling of the spark plug. What is the purpose of a bypass valve in an engine driven fuel pump? It allows fuel to flow around the pump for starting and for emergency operation if the pump should fail. On which side of the firewall is the engine fuel shutoff valve? Opposite side is the engine. What are three purposes of the boost pump in an aircraft fuel system? 1. To provide fuel for starting the engine. 2. To pressurize the fuel lines to prevent vapor lock. 3. To transfer fuel from one tank to another. 4. Backup in the event the engine driven fuel pump fails. What kind of boost pump is used in most aircraft fuel systems? Centrifugal. Where does an engine driven fuel pump direct the excess fuel from its pressure relief valve? Inlet side of pump. What causes vapor lock? Fuel becomes hot enough to boil and its vapors block the lines. What is done in most fuel systems to prevent vapor lock? Boost pumps in the tank pressurize the fuel in the lines and force the fuel into the fuel metering system. What is meant by a compensated relief valve in an engine driven fuel pump? A relief valve acted upon by a diaphragm and a spring atmospheric pressure acting on the diaphragm varies the pump discharge pressure so that it will remain a given amount higher than the pressure of the air entering the carburetor. What is the purpose of the pressurizing and dump valve in the fuel system for a turbine engine? For normal operation, the pressurizing and dump valve acts as a flow divider directing the fuel in the main or pilot manifold so it will be discharged from the proper orifice in the duplex fuel nozzle. Upon shutdown, the valve dumps all of the fuel from the manifold. What are the two basic types of jet fuel? Jet A Jet B What are two reasons Prist is used in jet fuel? Antifreeze and antimicrobial why do some aircraft fuel filters have a built-in relief valve? The relief valve will open and allow unfiltered fuel to circulate if plugged with ice or contaminants. What should be looked for when inspecting an engine-driven fuel pump? Leaks and security of mounting. What is the purpose of fuel selector valves? 1. Shut off fuel flow. 2. Cross feed for tank or engine selection. 3. Fuel transfer. What type of fuel pump is used with large reciprocating engines? Positive displacement rotary vane type pump. What is the purpose of an engine driven fuel pump? Continuous supply of fuel at the proper pressure at all times. What are three general causes of vapor lock? 1. Low fuel pressure. 2. High fuel temperatures. 3. Excessive fuel turbulence. Turbine engine fuel pumps may be divided into what two distinct categories? 1. Constant displacement pump. 2. Variable displacement pump. What category is a turbine engine gear type pump? Constant displacement pump. What type of fuel pump can be made to vary the fuel flow at any speed? Variable displacement pump. What part of a gas turbine engine fuel system is very susceptible to ice formation? Fuel filter. How is the engine fuel system protected from ice formation? Fuel heaters. Can you use automotive gas in a reciprocating engine in place of avgas? Yes, with the STC. Where is the heat taken that is used to heat the induction air in a reciprocating engine? From a muff installed around some part of the exhaust system. Where does alternate air come from that is used with a pressure carburetor or a fuel injection system? Inside the engine cowling. Where does carburetor ice normally form in a carburetor? 
in the throat of the carburetor on or around the throttle valve. Does the application of carburetor heat cause the fuel-air mixture to become leaner or richer? Richer. What is used to drive most of the external superchargers used on modern reciprocating engines? Exhaust gas. What controls the speed of a turbocharger compressor? The amount of exhaust gas that the wastegate allows to turn the turbine. What is meant by convergent inlet duct for a turbine engine? Divergent? Air duct becomes smaller, air duct becomes larger. What kind of inlet duct is often used on turbine-powered helicopters? Bell-mouthed inlet duct. What is the danger of operating an aircraft reciprocating engine with too high a carburetor air temperature? Higher fuel air mixture can reach its critical temperature and detonate. Why do some turbine engines use variable inlet guide vanes? These variable inlet guide vanes are automatically adjusted to direct the air into the engine in such a way that it keeps the RPM versus velocity proper for the most efficient operation. How do some turbine engines prevent ice formation of the variable inlet guide vanes? Hot compressor bleed air flow through hollow inlet guide vanes. What is usually installed in a large reciprocating engine between the turbocharger and the carburetor? Intercooler air-to-air -air heat exchanger. In what position should the carburetor heat control be placed when starting a reciprocating engine? Cold position. How does an engine air inlet vortex destroyer help prevent foreign damage to the engine? High velocity stream of compressor bleed air is blown out in front of the engine to break up the vortices that form in front of the engine when it is operating at high power on the ground. What type of power is used to control the position of the turbocharger wastegate on some engines? Oil pressure to an actuating piston. What can cause the wastegate to stick? Carbon buildup, coke buildup. What are the three major parts of a reciprocating engine induction system? Air scoop, fuel delivery system, intake manifold. What effect does induction ice have on an engine? Erratic, power loss, engine failure. How is ice cleared in some aircraft induction systems if the carburetor heat is too low? A fluid such as alcohol, aniline, or mersol is sprayed into the induction system ahead of the carburetor. The fluid will dislodge the ice which is ingested into the engine. Carburetor throttle ice is likely to form when the throttle is in what position? When the throttle butterfly is partially closed. What are the two general classifications of superchargers used in reciprocating engine induction systems? Internally driven, externally driven. What is the purpose of a distribution impeller in a radial engine? Breaks up fuel globules into finer particles. How does an internally driven supercharger get its power? A high-speed impeller is driven through a gear train from the crankshaft with single or two-stage gear ratios. Two-stage ratios vary from 6-1 to 12-1. Where does an externally driven supercharger get its power? Exhaust gases are directed against a turbine hence the term turbocharger. What is meant by pressure cooling of an aircraft engine? Air cooling in which air is forced to flow through baffles and cylinder fins by a pressure differential across the engine. What is the purpose of an augmenter tube in the cooling system of an aircraft? The augmenter tube uses the velocity of the exhaust gases to produce a low pressure on one side of the engine that helps pull cooling air through it. Where is the highest temperature located in the turbine engine? Inlet to the high pressure turbine. How are turbine inlet guide vanes and the first stage in some turbine engines cooled? High pressure compressor bleed air flows through the hollow guide vanes and hollow turbine blades. 
Which side of the air-cooled engine cylinder has the greatest amount of cooling fins? Exhaust valve side. What should be done to repair a bent cooling fin in a cast aluminum cylinder head? It is normally best to leave it alone if it does not restrict airflow. Cast fins are brittle. What is used in a helicopter to increase the amount of cooling air that flows over the engine cylinder? Belt driven fan. What should be the position of the cowl flaps on a reciprocating engine when it is run on the ground? Wide open. What is the function of the majority of the air that passes through a turbine engine? Cooling. How does the metallic sodium in an exhaust valve aid in transferring heat? The sodium picks up heat from the valve head and carries it to the stem so that it can be transferred to the cylinder head and dissipated in the air. How is the structure around the turbine engine protected from excessive heat from the engine? Insulating blanket protects the structure. What is the function of blast tubes that are installed in a pressure cooling system of a reciprocating engine? The blast tubes direct jets of cooling air to accessories of the engine that have high heat concentrations such as the magnetos and the generator. On radial engines, they duct air onto the rear spark plug elbow of each cylinder to prevent the overheating of cylinder leads. Of what material is the insulation blanket made that is used to protect the aircraft structure from the heat that is produced by a turbine engine? Fiberglass sandwich between sheets of metal foil. What is the purpose of the fins on engine cylinders? Increase surface area. Besides fins, what other engine characteristics are designed to aid in engine cooling? Cowling and baffles, blast tubes and augmenter tubes. Why is the open and close adjustment during the installation of cowl flaps important? For each engine installation, the cowl flaps are set for a tolerance that will permit them to open and close in the correct amount to keep the cylinder head temperature within allowable limits. What should be done to cylinders if too much of the cooling fin is broken off? A hot spot will develop so replace the cylinder. What publication should be consulted before reprofiling cylinder cooling fins? Manufacturer's service manual or overhaul manual to obtain allowable limits. What power sources are used to operate cow flaps? Electrical, hydraulic, mechanical. What are the main reasons why excessive heat in a reciprocating engine are undesirable? 1. Shortens life of engine parts. 2. Impairs lubrication. 3. Affects combustion. What is the source of air directed to engine bearings for cooling? Bleed air from the compressor section. What is the purpose of insulation in the vicinity of the exhaust duct of a turbine engine? 1. Reduce temperature of the structure in the vicinity of the exhaust or afterburner. 2. Prevent oil and fuel from coming in contact with hot parts of the engine. What TS of materials are used to make insulation blankets for turbine engines? They are made of stainless steel, layers of aluminum foil, fiberglass, and silver foil. What areas of the turbine engine are cooled by the secondary air passing through the engine? Combustion chamber and turbine. What is the purpose of the engine cowling? 1. Streamlines the engine to reduce drag. 2. Forms an envelope around the engine which forces an airstream between the cylinders to cool them. What is the purpose of an oil cooler bypass valve? It allows the thick oil to bypass the cooler when the engine is cold. Of what material are most reciprocating engine exhaust components made? Corrosion resistant steel. How is the speed of a turbocharger controlled? By controlling the amount of exhaust gas that flows through the turbine, this is controlled by the position of the wastegate that is in the exhaust pipe. 
What type actuator is used to control the position of the turbocharger wastegate? A hydraulic actuator that uses engine oil pressure to move a piston. How does the power recovery turbine increase the power of a reciprocating engine? Exhaust driven velocity turbines are coupled through a hydraulic drive to the engine crankshaft. Energy that would normally be lost is used to drive the turbines and the turbines assist in turning the crankshaft. How tight should the clamps be tightened that hold sections of a reciprocating engine exhaust system together? They should not be so tight that they will be damaged when it expands the exhaust system components. What would be the effect on engine performance of an internal failure of a muffler? Exhaust back pressure will cause a loss of power. What effect on turbine engine operation is caused by a change in the area of the exhaust nozzle? Altering the area of the exhaust nozzle affects the compression ratio, the RPM, the mass air flow through the engine and the EGT. How does a noise suppressor reduce the amount of noise produced by a turbojet engine? It breaks up the low frequency vibrations in the exhaust stream and converts them into higher frequencies. High frequencies are dissipated by the air more easily than low frequencies. What is the purpose of ball joints and bellows in the exhaust system of a reciprocating engine? They allow exhaust system components to change their dimensions without causing any leaks. Why do some supersonic aircraft use a convergent-divergent exhaust duct? A CD exhaust duct controls the gas expansion as it leaves the engine so the gases will produce thrust at supersonic velocities. Why is it important that a lead pencil never be used to mark on an aircraft exhaust duct? The graphite will infuse the metal when it gets hot. It makes the metal brittle and subject to cracking. What type of damage is normally found in the hot section of a turbine engine? Cracks caused by heat. What is the most common damage found in exhaust systems? Cracks caused by expansion and contraction. What should be the condition of the wastegate when starting an engine? Fully open. Why are thrust reversers not normally used during ground operation? The danger of blowing foreign objects in the intake stream is too great. What are two types of reciprocating engine exhaust systems? Short stack and collector stack. What are possible hazards of exhaust system failure? 1. Carbon monoxide poisoning 2. Partial or complete loss of engine power 3. Fire What type of exhaust system is used on supercharged engines? Collector What type of exhaust system creates the highest back pressure? Collector What type of exhaust system is used on low-powered non-supercharged engines? Short stack. What is the purpose of a reciprocating engine exhaust system? 1. Remove heat. 2. Remove noxious gases. What happens when lead, zinc, or galvanized marks are made on an exhaust system? Molecular change causing weakened, brittle metal. What type of visual can be seen in the area of an exhaust leak? Flat gray or city black carbon streaks. How are ceramic coated exhaust stacks cleaned? By the degreasing method only. What are the usual cause of muffler and heat exchanger failures? Concentrated areas of thermal stress or vibrational stress. Where are exhaust manifold and stack failures most likely to occur? Weld, flanges, clamp points. What are the probes in a turbine exhaust pipe used for? EGT in pressure. What is the purpose of a wastegate? It is a valve that controls the amount of exhaust gas forced through the turbocharger turbine. When the gate is fully closed, all gases must pass through the turbine. 
What device is used on propeller blades to remove ice that has formed on them? Electrically heated de-icer boots. What is used to prevent ice forming on propeller blades? Mixture of ethylene glycol and isopropyl alcohol. Should an adjustable pitch propeller be in high pitch or low pitch for takeoff? Low pitch. What is done to cause a hydromatic propeller to feather? High pressure engine oil is directed into the propeller through the governor. What is done to cause a Macaulay propeller to feather? Oil is allowed to drain out of the propeller. Does centrifugal twisting motion on a propeller blade tend to move the blades toward high pitch or low pitch? Low pitch. Do the counterweights of a propeller tend to move the blades toward high pitch or low pitch? High pitch. What is the difference between a controllable propeller and a constant speed propeller? A controllable pitch propeller uses a manually operated oil valve to control pitch. A constant speed propeller uses a governor to control the valve. When making a magneto check on an engine equipped with a constant speed propeller, should the propeller control be in high pitch or low pitch? Low pitch. What can be done to prevent the front cone from bottoming when installing a propeller on a spline shaft? Install a spacer behind the rear cone to move the propeller forward on the shaft. What is the purpose of the small holes that are drilled in the end of the wooden propeller? Releases moisture. What is the purpose of the snap ring inside the hub of a propeller that is mounted on a tapered or spawn shaft? The snap ring allows the propeller to be pulled off of the shaft when the retaining nut is backed off. What is adjusted inside the governor for a constant speed propeller to change the speed at which the propeller is operating? Compression of the speeder ring. What is the function of the accumulator that is used with the Macaulay feathering propellers? The accumulator stores oil used to move the propeller to low pitch when it is being unfeathered. What is meant by beta range of operation of a turboprop propeller? It is a ground operation mode which includes starting, taxiing, and ground reverse. What is meant by the alpha range of operation of a turboprop propeller? In-flight mode of operation from takeoff to landing. If the flat surface of the propeller blade the face or the back of the propeller? Face. What keeps a Macaulay feathering propeller from feathering when the engine is shut down on the ground? What adjustment are mechanics allowed to make to the prop governor? Maximum RPM stop. What pitch direction do the counterweights move the prop? Toward the high pitch. Why are propellers indexed to the crankshaft of the engine? Reduce vibrations. Can transverse cracks be repaired? No, transverse cracks of any size are unacceptable. What is the purpose of a propeller? Create thrust. What are two types of propeller configurations? Tractor type and pusher type. What type of propeller has the blade angle built into the propeller and cannot be changed? Fixed pitch propeller. What tool is used to determine the propeller blade angle? Universal propeller protractor. What are the aerodynamic loads and forces acting on a rotating propeller blade? 1. Centrifugal force pulled away of hub 2. Aerodynamic twisting force. Course pitch 3. Centrifugal twisting force. Fine pitch 4. Torque bending force. Away from the center of rotation 5. Thrust bending force. Blades bend forward. What should be used to clean aluminum and steel propeller blades and hubs? Suitable cleaning solvent using a brush or cloth. 
What positions are used on a balance stand to check a two-bladed propeller for static balance? First the vertical, then the horizontal. Can a fixed pitch propeller be changed? No, they are fixed at a specific pitch angle. What do you put the blades of a counterweight propeller into high pitch before stopping the engine? This type of propeller has a movable cylinder that slides over a fixed piston. In the high pitch position, this cylinder moves inboard and covers the piston, protecting it from dirt and moisture. Why are cones installed on spine shafts with a propeller? The cones center the propeller on the shaft as they are forced toward each other by the tightening of the retaining nut. What types of systems are used for de-icing propellers? Fluid or electrical de-icing systems. How is feathering accomplished in a constant speed counterweight propeller? By releasing governor oil pressure on the counterweights, the feathering spring moves the blades to the feathered position and the oil returns to the engine. What is blade tracking? The process of determining the position of the tips of propellers' blades relative to each other. What should you adjust if a pilot requests 50 more RPM on an aircraft equipped with a constant speed propeller? Adjust the governor's prop lever stop screw. When changing metal bushings on a wooden propeller assembly, a thorough inspection of the bolt holes should be accomplished. Why? To check for elongated bolt holes. How is most troubleshooting done on most modern APUs? FATIC What is the typical relationship between an APU generator and the engine-driven generator? They are identical. Where does the APU fuel supply normally come from? Airplane's main fuel supply. How is the APU rotated during startup? Electric starter. What is the function of an APU air inlet plenum? Stabilize the pressure of the air before it enters the compressor. When operating at high loads, what is the speed of an APU? The APU remains at or near rated speed regardless of the load condition. What is the effect of the pneumatic power when being used in conjunction with maximum APU shaft power output? The pneumatic loading will be automatically modulated to maintain a safe EGT. Before shutdown, how would APU cooling be accomplished? By closing the bleed air valve, thus removing the load. When is most of the load placed on an APU? When bleed air is opened. What regulates fuel scheduling during APU start and under varying pneumatic bleed and electrical loads? Fuel scheduling is maintained automatically by the APU fuel control system. What is the primary function of the load compressor on APUs equipped with a free turbine and load compressor? To provide bleed air for aircraft pneumatic systems. To prevent rotor seizure shock cooling, how long should an APU idle before being shut down? 3 to 5 minutes.